Certainly didn't affect my rankings, did it? Didn't get penalized, didn't get slapped out of the rankings. I do this stuff all the time for different markets. Three blogs in any market. I got a nice little thing here, but I don't think I have a pen to write on. Each blog gets treated as its own authority site. Do you know what I mean by that? That means you have someone going out there and getting incoming links or submitting your RSS feeds and bookmarking thing all over the internet. So each individual blog is treated as an authority site. An authority site does not mean people actually think you're an authority necessarily, although that's, that's really what it's supposed to mean. What it means is that the search engines find links pointing to it all over the internet. It doesn't mean I'm authority on search engine voodoo. It just means that the search engines say enough people link to my search engine voodoo site for whatever the keywords are that they consider it to be a mini authority site. So for the last three or four years, actually this site was built in when I spoke at Yannick Silver's underground event in 2005. So I paid $250 to have this beautiful site specially made for me and it has generated me hundreds upon hundreds upon hundreds of thousands of dollars and I haven't really touched it in the last couple of years other than using it to use my blog and ping techniques that I still use to this day that I told the world how to do four years ago. It still works, doesn't it? $600, 21,000 total commission. I can say probably of that 50, 20 of those sales came from the search engine. I can't say for absolute certainty, but I can say my last email went on the 12th. Two days after that, I was at around 15 sales, and Evan just told me today I didn't email again. So for two days after that, between those two days after the last email went out, I added another 20 some odd sales. Some of it was more email follow up, but I also do this stuff other than when I test it, I do it without doing emails at all. But Ivan's a buddy of mine. I didn't do it just for a test. I did it because I wanted to make some sales and send him some traffic. But I do this stuff for stuff all the time, <laughs> stuff for stuff, where I just go out there and there's no email involved whatsoever. I used to not use email at all. First couple of years, you guys heard me say a thousand times, I didn't collect emails. That's all I, you know, I didn't collect any emails. But this is the type of stuff I did. It was all search engine traffic driven this way. Anybody could do it. Three blogs. Take each blog in your market, you got a market, you want a digital camera market, you want a consumer electronics market, put up three blogs minimum. And then have people pay someone to go out there, pennies to go out there and get links and stuff coming in for you. The important thing also is the domains are aged, because they look at how old the domain is. Dory talked about that, how important it is, why she likes to buy sites that haven't been deleted but have expired and they can change ownership without losing their history, so to speak, because they're aged. I've been, You've got to age your sites. So anytime you register domains, you should be putting up a holder page with the keywords on it. So let's say that um, they have this term, I think it's called blog selling. So let's say you found other blogs that have traffic that you want to sell into. Could you talk about maybe how you would recommend doing that? Or I'm not certain what the question is. So in other words, how would you, so let's say I find blogs that I want somehow my comments to get posted on their blogs. How would you recommend doing that? Oh, in the video tutorials, I show you how to use a tool, a free tool, that you can see the buzz that's going on in the blogs that are out there, and I talk about how you want to target those blogs. There's actually a software tool I just saw Chris had mailed out. Um, I haven't used it, but uh, in the video, I show you how to do that because I say when you, when you do that and you've got a site, you go over, do the blog search, and I think it was, I can't remember which site it was. I told you, it's in the video. But over there, then I talked about how you can find the blogs that are experts and authorities in the markets that you're targeting. And then it's your job to go over there. And you, one of the techniques I've taught is you can track back them. So one thing I said in that video is you, f you, go, to the, you go to the tool I mentioned in the video, you do the searches, you find the authority blogs, you then go over to the authority blog, you find the, the permalink, which is this link up top here. That's really, well, if I post that, that's a permalink. You find the permalink on the blog, and then you go to your little blog in that market, and you put that permalink in your blog post. And that sends out a signal to the authority site that says, somebody just talked about your blog. Software is set up, so what can happen is you can, they, they might see your comment, it comes through, and they get a notification of comment, or someone's pinged them. They can actually prove to then go ahead, and they take your blog's comment, and they put it on their blog. Software can be set up so they can actually automatically allow it to show up on their blog, but if for no other reason you're linking out to an authority site that Google likes, which is important, 
and you're trying to get their attention. So let's say you're in the market and you want to do business with that person. Well, if they see that you've been sending, you know, you've been linking to them and mentioning their blog and your blog, how much easier is for you is it for you to approach them and say, hey, I'd like to put some content on your site, I'd like to buy some links, I'd like to do some business together. Right? They say, oh yeah, I remember you. I've seen you've been posting things on your blog about me. I appreciate it. And in fact, their, their software would be configured that says, whenever somebody tracks me back like that, automatically link back to them.